Hello, I'm Mike Mullen, author of Ashfall and Surface Tension, and this is my overly affectionate cat, Zippy, who decided at the last minute he wanted to be in this video too. So I've been asked to uh, make a video for my fellow readers about how and why I'm a reader today. Quit putting your tail in my face. Yeah, he's not very obedient. He's a cat. Uh, and I'm really a reader because uh, of my mother. My mother um, was a teacher before I was born, a librarian when I was growing up, and is now a bookstore owner. And so I grew up around books and reading books, and it was very natural to me. But the, probably the moment when I became the crazed uh, read uh, 100, 150 books a year person that I am now was fourth grade. The best uh, holiday gift I ever got was uh, Christmas of fourth grade. I got uh, this. I still have it. The box set of the Chronicles of Narnia. You can see my folks paid eight ninety five for it. They didn't even take the price sticker off. That's kind of weird, but oh well. So obviously it was a long time ago. Seven books for eight ninety five. That was the deal. Anyway, uh, I read this uh, series uh, eleven times over the uh, course of the next year, uh, and I kept track with hash marks in here. You can see there are thirteen um, because I've read it twice since then. And uh, actually, the funny story I can tell you about this is uh, I actually I hated fourth grade. It was terrible. I had a, a teacher who I swear was uh, born of the devil, Mrs. Walsh. And uh, she liked to sit up and lecture to the about reading. I preferred reading, actually. And I think that's why I'm good at reading, uh, because I didn't listen to her lectures. Instead, I sat in her class and read The Horse and His Boy. This is my favorite one of the uh, series. Uh, maybe you can tell it's almost read to death. And so I was in uh, Mrs. Walsh's fourth grade classroom, reading this under my desk, you know, like this, while she was uh, lecturing about reading. And uh, she caught me, and she was sick of me, so she said, uh, Michael, if all you're going to do in my class is sit there and read your book, you can go out in the hall and do it. And so I very calmly stood up, walked out into the hall, sat down in the study carol, and read the rest of the day. It was the best day of fourth grade ever. So uh, don't let anyone stop you from reading. Even teachers, sadly, sometimes do it. Uh, most of them are great, but there are a few bad ones, and I had the unfortunate, uh, uh, <coughs> unfortunate bad luck to meet several of those in my school career. So uh, happy reading, and that's my little story about how I became a reader. Thanks.